It is dawn here in Florida. All right, a little past dawn. It's about sunrise on a cloudy, chilly 70 degree winter day here in Florida. And we have a mystery on our hands, everybody. We have a mystery on our hands because this water trough that you see right here continues to move from location to location. This water trough used to be all the way over there in that corner. And now it's here in this corner. How did it get here? Huh, I wonder who's doing it. This video is going to take you through my detective work on figuring out how this water trough has been making it tens of yards, hundreds and hundreds of feet <laughs> from one side of the pasture to the other. I wonder how it got here. Hmm, do you know? Do you know how it made it all the way from that corner of the pasture to this corner? Now there are only a few animals here that could do this. We have two cows and two horses and two goats. The goats are pretty small though. I will say Peter Goat, our buck, while he weighs less than 50 pounds, would, would put up a good fight against the water trough, though he likes to jump on it more than anything. <laughs> Peter Goat has met his match. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh. So now the water trough is next to the garden. It was way over there in my last video in that corner to the left, the top left corner. And then somehow it made it to here. Who's the mystery responsible agent here? Who's the, who's the person or animal responsible for this? This is my guess right here. Any other thoughts? I don't think you're strong enough. I don't think you're smart enough. I don't think you would do it. Look at this. <laughs> I first noticed this because this water trough used to be way over there in the far corner of the pasture. So far that we hadn't even checked to see if it was usable. You know, we, we saw that it was like turned over on its side every once in a while we'd walk past it and see it. And I don't know, we just didn't stop to check. And it was just so far out that on the days I had time, like, uh, I need to go check that water trough because we could use it, but I don't even know if it's got holes in it. One that we have on the other pasture has huge holes in it from the pre previous owner or somebody, I don't know, like drilled holes in it, not exactly sure why. And um, I want to use it for my cold plunge. I don't know if any of y'all do that. The Wim Hof method, you know, really cold water in there though. I'm, I'm thinking about buying something that chills the water for you because if I use the horse water trough and ice I think that could become an expensive habit having to fill up bags of ice over time you know over time two bags of ice two bags of ice two bags of ice over time so anyway uh back to the mystery at hand I noticed that this water trough which was very far away was somehow getting closer and closer to the front of the pasture <laughs> such a punk. You are such a punk. I know. I agree. He's a punk. Now that we've seen daddy cow going at it, obviously this is the problem. Daddy cow was doing this when he was really daddy cow and he still had his parts. And so far it's basically the only activity that he is still doing that he was doing as a bull, which I think is a good thing. I don't see him mounting mommy cow anymore. And that was one thing we wanted to stop. And he has not become aggressive so far. We are able to be in the pasture with him still, even with food. 
and he's still pretty scared if you go wow you know he doesn't <laughs> he doesn't come after you he's fun actually he's a lot of fun I've gotten more comfortable with him you know being around him I've never been around cows before really you know like in a pen with them um especially one that was a bull at one point in the recent future or past sorry it's like I said it's early <laughs> um so anyway he's he's he would be he'd be he'd be a lot harder to eat right now than he was when we first got here. I'm feeling something behind me right now. Oh. You again. You again. Anyway. So that's it. That's the that's the uh, Nancy Drew mystery out here, okay? Everybody, hope you have a great Thanksgiving. Well, after this video's up, you probably have already had Thanksgiving. So, anyway, hope it went well. See you next time.